Hey, it's Caitlin from Streets Ahead Style, and I am here today with a brand new collection from Paint It Pretty Polish. This is a collection of toppers, but you can actually build them up to be pretty opaque on their own. But of course, you could layer them over anything, and you've basically got like three polishes in one. They're very versatile. They look amazing. They're very affordable. Yeah, I'll stop yammering and get into the swatches, but before I do, please go into the description below and check out my blog post where I have more photos and a full written review of the polishes and a link to the Paint It Pretty Polish shop. <laughs> I almost got tongue tied. Anyway, I will get into the swatches. All right, here we go. So the first polish is Paint It Pretty Polish Top Me Up. And this is a bronze to gold color shifting flaky topper. So this one, as you're going to see in all of the videos, um, I applied three coats. I built it up on its own in three coats on my index finger. And then on my middle finger, you're seeing me put two coats over black. So I'm going to do that in all of the videos, all of the clips. So this polish has a great formula. The flakies build up amazingly. And oh my gosh, if you love gold and bronze, then this topper is absolutely for you. It's just so rich and sort of antiqued looking. It's absolutely perfect for fall. And I think it looks incredible over black. And I also love it on its own. The second polish we have is Paint It Pretty Polish all topped up. And this one is a purple to red to gold color shifting flaky nail polish topper. So as you can see, I'm building it up here on its own on my index finger and then applying it over the black and over the black you just really see that trio color shift and you're absolutely going to see it when I do my finger dance so I think I will just let you watch and enjoy and check out the magic of this flaky topper. <laughs> So this next polish is called Topping Around, and this is described as a blue to purple to magenta color shifting flaky topper. And wow, okay, this one is like so beautiful. I just really love it so much. Um, I really think this one would look amazing over a dark purple or maybe a navy blue. I'm imagining how beautiful that would look, but... As you can see, the flakies are just so multi-dimensional and rich. Um, whether you wear them on their own or over the black, it's just, yeah, there's just such a shift as you can see me do my finger dance. And don't feel weird if you're getting confused by all the names because I have to be honest and say I did too. There's a lot of tops. Every polish has the word top in it. So it definitely... Um, gets a little confusing but hopefully my labels there will help you and you can check out my blog post too which will hopefully prevent any confusion so off the top now this one is my absolute favorite because the flakies are so tiny so cute so perfectly sized and it's a teal to purple to red color shift which are all my colors and I think it's just absolutely beautiful um yeah, as you see me build it up here, like you can just see that combination, how beautiful it is, and also just how beautiful it is over black. Like, look at it. You're basically also getting like oranges and golds when you go to the extreme tips of my nails. So it's so beautiful. And with all of these toppers, the possibilities are kind of endless because you can layer them, you can not layer them, you can really do whatever you want with them. So it's a really great collection. Okay, now we have over the top and over the top is described as a violet to red to gold to green color shifting flaky topper. So this one really pops over the black once again, but I also really liked it on its own here. And I will note about the formulas that... Um, when it comes to building these up on their own in three coats like I'm doing on my index finger, I would recommend taking it easy, taking it slow because there are so many flakies in there. You don't want to, you know, drag them or 
you know, get like a really lumpy finish. So I would highly recommend waiting until each coat is quite dry before adding another layer, especially when you're building them up on their own. So that's my pro tip. The polish I'm swatching in this clip is topped off and it is a violet to purple to pink to gold color shifting topper. And this one is another favorite. I mean, it's a close second to the other one that I really loved because this color shift is just so beautiful. And as you're going to see in my finger dance, when you get to those extreme angles, here it's coming, wait for it, there. Like it's like gold and green and orange and so beautiful. And I don't know, I feel like I could do a little finger dance on my hand and just watch it all day long. Anyone else? No, just me? No, I think, I think you guys understand what I'm talking about. <laughs> Okay, this one is called Top of the Morning, which like I'm immediately picturing some sort of like little leprechaun when I think of Top of the Morning. Um, this one is a green to blue to purple to red color shifting flaky topper. It is really beautiful. So um, as you can see here, just building it up, these flakies are so dimensional. Like some of them have two color shifts some have three this is the one that has four um yeah so it's really beautiful i especially love this one layered over black i think it looks so amazing so this is the last one and it is called put your top on and i found this one to be more sparse than the other ones like as you can see on my index finger there wasn't a ton that came out in the first coat so this one might be a little harder to build up to opacity even though i do think I ended up with it pretty opaque um, it wouldn't absolutely get you there so for a lot of people who don't love seeing their nail I'm gonna say this is probably not the collection you just wear on its own so you're definitely want to get want to use them as toppers but I personally don't mind seeing my bare nail through the nail polish so that one also had a huge hunk of chunk of flake on my index, which you probably saw, and that was really fun to get in the bottle. But yeah, gorgeous collection. And as you can see here, they all look quite different. Um, I wanted to show you a little side by side so you could see, you know, if you were wondering like, okay, girl, these all look the same. I'm proving to you right here with all eight, they are all very different. So that meme, they're similar, not the same. Therefore, if you like them, you can definitely justify getting all of them because they're all quite different and beautiful in their own way. Also available this month until September 30th is the Pretty Polish of the Month, which I didn't actually film myself swatching, but I do have photos of it. I will link that blog post down below. I'll also probably put the nail polish beside me somewhere so you can check it out, but it's super pretty, it's blue, and if you're a blue lover, this one does not disappoint. So definitely check that one out before it's gone. And in terms of the collection of fall toppers, um, I would have to say my absolute favorite, if I had to pick one, is Topped Off. And that one, I think it's a combination of the colors and the shift, which I just found so beautiful. And also the size of the flakes. The flakes in this one were like, really tiny which i personally love and i can see myself wearing this over like a sheer um white or pink but yeah let me know in the comments if these toppers are your thing if you like toppers if you're not really into them or if you were really inspired by any of these and you have already imagined a beautiful combination in your head i guess i will see you in the next video bye